everybody, we're going back to Europe. Whoop, whoop. Uh, yeah, this is like maybe our 10th trip, but uh, second time we're going to run a study abroad program uh, for the months of May and June. It's going to be two months, uh, seven, eight countries. Yeah, we're very excited to have a new crew uh, to come, and I hope you guys might be one of them. Yeah, we're looking for people. We had such a great bunch last year, about 20 of us. Wish we could take them all again. I really do. I know, they're awesome. But you guys are going to be awesome too. Yep. And so, uh, if you'd like to come join us, uh, basically, we travel around Europe. Uh, we're gonna take we're gonna take four classes, uh, two classes where we read through the Bible, uh, two classes on uh, European cultural geography, introduction to French society, things like that. And mm-hmm. it, it's great learning because you're actually learning in the location that where you're you studying. Learn it. Yeah, yeah. Exactly right. super interesting. So we're gonna start off with a, a, like a five six day trip um, around northern France. We're gonna see all these places listed. Uh, actually, all these pictures are the order we're doing the trip in. The exciting thing is this year we actually have a home where we get to stay. Yeah. So you get to stay in a castle this year. We bought a place for you guys and for us. Uh, we haven't we haven't decorated it clearly, so these are just shots of when we were looking at purchasing it. But we're gonna live in this thing for five weeks, and uh, that's gonna be our our, uh, our kitchen, our dining hall. That will be. Yeah. Uh, we'll spend like hours a day reading through the scriptures, New Testament survey, Old Testament survey, and then staying upstairs in in some of these bedrooms. Each pretty much each will have a bathroom. Yeah. Close. Well, that's good. That is good. That'll help us. It is good. We'll have to deal with the, you know, some of the decorations for this year. But, yeah. Uh, yeah. So if you're if you're a purist, you know, give us some time. We'll, we'll make it beautiful. <laughs> but the chateau is pretty cool. It is lovely. I mean, who lives in a French castle? I don't know. Apparently, we're us. going to. Yeah. <laughs> uh, by the way, five thousand bucks, uh, two months. Uh, yeah. Just in case you're wondering about that. Um, and, and 12 12 credit hours can transfer to some schools. Like my school at Multnomah University, a wonderful mm-hmm. university, will accept 12 hours of transfer credit. Well, and we've had other universities actually. Um, yeah, but let's not talk about them. Yeah. Okay. But yeah, there have been a few other schools that have taken it too. But guarantee, guarantee Multnomah will take it. Okay, uh, so maybe your school. Please. Right there, you just saw it's an amazing chateau in Angers and these castles. Say. They're all super close by, so these are like day trips for yeah. us. We'll do like a bunch of cool day trips while we're there. Um, and then at the end of the trip, we'll finish off this 15 day swing through Europe. Uh, we're going to look at Verdun, this is Metz, over to Belgium, Luxembourg, and then to Germany. Yep, that's Heidelberg. Oh man, I love, love Heidelberg. Yeah, and then uh, Munich, concentration uh, camp. Yeah, camp. Yeah, it's, uh, really cool. Down to Venice, uh, Slovenia, hopefully. And Rome. Yeah, I'm Italy. Gonna we're going to do Rome. We'll do Italy really well. Like, Four days in Rome, and then a couple days in Tuscany, uh, the Vatican, and we're going to stay in Switzerland on the way out for one day, and then back to Paris, and you fly home. 